What's up, fam? Thank y'all for taking the call. It's Joey. Uh, thanks for being here. Okay. Um, what I was going to say, I was going to say, sending everybody uh, much love and light. Okay. Uh, welcome back to the channel, my OG. Thank y'all for y'all continued love and support. Uh, thank you to everybody who's been uh, sending super chats. I really do appreciate that. Thank y'all for everybody who's been liking the videos, who's been uh, subscribing to the channel, and who, who's also been commenting, po your positive comments. Thank y'all so much. I really do appreciate that. Let's go ahead and clear the energy out here, too. Um, <sighs> y'all, I don't know if y'all been picking this energy up, too, but it just seems a little weird. Like, the energy is, like, mad weird out within the collective right now. We're out in the world right now. Within the collective, online, offline, it's just a bunch of weird energy. And I was alerted that we were in a retrograde right now. And then Mercury retrograde is, what's today? Is about to come up. So, you know, you can feel that before it happens. So that's about to come up too. So I'm like, yo, is that why all the energy? Yo, it's just mad weird right now. A lot of weird energy right now. And I've been guided to do a reading on the weird energy. Okay. Wait, let me let me see. I had uh, left my own tarot deck in my bag. Let me see. Yeah. Because when I was at work, I had pulled a couple of cards too. To see if I should do it. And yes, it's a flying yes. And we're going to see. I'm going to see. I'ma see. I want to see too. I want to see what's going on right now. What we need to. What we need to look out for. Cause the this card. I got this card last night about spiral. Like something spiraling. Like when you see this, you see like something spiraling out of control, or something hypnotizing you, something uh, confusing you. It also reminds me of like a hurricane, like like a storm happening. But I'm getting, it, it's giving me a lot of like mental, you know what I'm saying? Like mental confusion or a, like a lot of mixed up energies and stuff like that. You know what I mean? And at first I was going to put that back in there until I saw this on the bottom of the deck, which was talking about a red flag. So I was like, oh Lord, here we go. What we need to, what we need to know with this red flag. I want y'all to know, know too, that a lot of y'all, y'all, y'all empaths. Y'all got them psychic gifts and abilities, spiritual gifts and abilities, however you, whatever label you put on it, however you describe it, okay? Um, especially if you resonate with being a psychic, a reader, or just an intuitive, okay? I'm getting light workers, star seeds, empaths. You, you can feel energy. You may be feeling this energy very, very heavily, right? You may be picking it up more than the average person is picking it up right now, all right? I'm getting... Cause we got psychic here. Oh, I'm about to sneeze. Mm. We got psychic here. We got killer here. Um, secret life here. School, and then love. I feel like right now there's a lot of lessons that's taking place right now, right? There's a lot of energy around the collective in general, with. It's giving me this killer and secret life is giving me like some some covert some co like this covert energy that I'm picking up to that can be really trying to throw you off that could really be trying to oh and I see and I just saw the witness I saw the witness on this card so it's kind of giving me like it's giving me that sentinel energy from like the matrix y'all seen that movie Comment down below if you've seen the movie. It's giving me that sentinel energy from the Matrix to where, like, you know, uh, the sentinels can feel, like, the person's energy or whatnot. That's what I'm getting. It's, it, I'm getting, like, as soon as you're vibrating at a certain level, as soon as you you broadcasting your gifts and abilities, as soon as you get to that level to where they could, you know, their, their alarm systems can pick it up, then they own you. You feel me? I feel like this is something going on behind the scenes and it has to do about what you're learning, what you are teaching. Okay. And I feel like it centers around love. It centers around the love energy here. What you're teaching, what you are learning at this time. Let me, pick, let me pull another one. 
I'm, I'm pulling some cards from I'm all over the place right now I'm going with the spiral you know what I'm saying the energy is all over the place so I'm, I might be all, all all over the place right now I'm pulling something from this one right here I just got confirmation in my ear what was that a news break oh wow it talks about a rapper that was found deceased what in the world and it talks about in Florida hurricanes i don't know what's going on and oh my god look at this look at this show and i just got that i just got this let me see if they'll show it i just got this notification right here look at that y'all i just got this notification right here and i'm just looking at this car right here oh what in the world bro Y'all could be hearing about uh, celebrities, just like we just heard. Y'all may be hearing about celebrities, some stuff happening to celebrities right now. Uh, they may be involved in some secret dealings. Well, what else we got here? We got warriors. You guys are warriors here. <laughs> I just I just saw a savage. That savage is out here. Yeah, very, very strong. Okay? That's a good thing. We are very, very strong, so keep keep on moving through all the spirals okay keep on moving through all the red flags keep on moving through everything but make sure that you're paying attention is what i'm getting with the red flags make sure that you're paying attention like i'm like i'm saying like for yahoo's tapped and tuned in this energy might hit you a little hard to where i'm getting don't let it don't let the energy cause you to spiral out of control all right because this could be the energy coming off of events and things that are happening that don't have nothing to do with you, okay? It could be just energy in the collective that's still affecting you. Energy around you in your house is still affecting you. Some of you guys just, oh, I just heard, be careful with these entities that might work through people to try to get you triggered. Be careful with that, okay? Because they, uh, I'm seeing... If you're not going into this energy on your own, there could be people that are around you, that, that, that are closest to you, trying to push you into this this, this confusing energy. Because it, it's giving me like they want you um, discombobulated. They want you uh, out of balance. They want you low-key loopy, okay? We got doctor. What else we got here? What is this doctor about? broken heart here we got broken heart underneath underneath the deck so either you or somebody that's around you may be having a broken heart okay may need to heal your broken heart may need to start healing from the things that happened to you in the past heal from traumas okay where is it this y'all see this y'all see i'm talking about the energy is all over the place compass okay this is i'm hearing your inner guide trust your inner guide to lead you down the right direction okay Somebody here, you're being healed from a broken heart. Somebody here, you're being healed from disappointments. Okay, look at this, yo. Yeah, that's why we got this love energy right here. You're being healed from a broken heart. You're being healed from the past so that you can move forward, so that you can move back into love and compassion for yourself. Okay, and then you'll be able to experience that out in the world. I'm not here. I'm not getting. I'm not getting to go for right now, right? I'm getting to, to abide your time, okay? And let. Cause there's some new beginnings that are happening to let things take place all right yep you got people around you who, who are wearing masks and this could be an elder this could be your mother this could be your father okay this could be somebody who's your aunt whoever you're close to this could be somebody who's older than you this person is wearing some sort of mask this person has some sort of, some sort of ulterior motives with you okay be careful y'all know oh i get it now Be careful of somebody who's an elder. For some of y'all, this person used to be a couple years older than you, but I'm getting like an elderly person for a lot of people here. This could be your mother, your father, your uncle, your aunt, or your grand grandmother, grandfather, or just somebody who you're close to that's older. Hell, this could be somebody on your job that's older. You feel me? But I feel like you need to be careful with this person because you're going to be seeing some odd, odd, um, you're going to be seeing some odd um how do i say it 
See, I can't even, I can't even verbalize it. I got it right here. You feel me? But it's like getting it out. You're going to receive, you're going to, uh, behavior, odd behavior. You are going to be experiencing some odd behavior from this elder person. Okay. Whoever this elder person is, you're going to be receiving some odd behavior from this person. Spirit say, pay attention to the red flags. This person is trying to trigger you. Whoever it is, I don't care if it's your mother, your father. I don't care who it is. This elder person is wearing a mask and they're trying to trigger you to get you into this spiral type of energy. That energy is like, have you going around in circles, get you caught in karmic cycles, get you confused, get you to not know where you're going, not know where you, be, not, not know, oh, I'm getting, not know where you're beginning, you ending, you feel me? Like, to, I'm getting, do not get your energy just so wrapped up in these people's energy, okay? Because I'm getting some weird vibes from this energy here, okay? It's, it's reminding me of that movie. Yeah, somebody think somebody somebody's let me tell you something. Whoever this person is, like I said, for some of y'all it's gonna be somebody who's significantly older than you. For some of you guys it's gonna be somebody who's just a couple of months, couple of years, whatever, older than you, right? But whoever this person is trying to trigger you, that is their MO right now, okay? You're somebody you got gifts and abilities, okay? They see it. You feel me? You may be around here, uh somebody around here, you're a truth teller, you are <laughs> I'm hearing fighting crime out here in these spiritual streets and um, you keeping it like to yourself, right? This person knows about this, though. This is somebody who knows about this, who knows about your gifts and abilities. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know how you're doing it. But whoever this is, they know about your gifts and your abilities. And this person is trying to trigger you to get you into this spiral energy. OK, and then and look at them. Look at them right here, like eating their popcorn, just waiting, just waiting to see you get I, I'm out here and waiting to see you hot and bothered because there's this there's a sensitivity about yourself right now. You you may be in a sensitive. Yeah, look at this. You may be in a sensitive type of energy right now, especially with the psychic energy here. You may be in a sensitive type of energy, uh, sensitive type of flow to where you're picking. You pick up on vibrations super easily and that might cause you to become moody. So be careful with that. OK. This person is trying to trigger your broken heart. This person is trying to trigger. If you had some sort of disappointment, this person knows what they're doing. Okay. This person is either because I just heard energize the bunny battery in their back. This person could be being. This person could be being uh, pushed to do this by somebody else or an entity. Okay. This person could be under some sort of demonic influence. And that energy has been coming up a lot lately. This is somebody who wants to see you go off. Look at this poison. Look at this, bro. Something to do with your job. We got trident. This giving me that devil type of energy, right? They don't want you to, bro. Look at this, bro. Look at this. Let's break it down. Somebody, somebody waiting for you. This person wants you to go off and they want to sit back and, and watch you go off. Sit back and watch you get triggered. Sit back and watch you spiral out of control. Because you're in you, the control you in right now is actually taking you places. So that's why it's imperative that you maintain your, your, your control, right? You maintain your, your vibration because it's taking you somewhere. It's, it's actually moving you forward finally in life. Okay, I'm gonna go over these tarot cards in a minute that I pull, but it's finally moving you forward. And this person is trying to sit, like sit back. I'm seeing like demonic forces, you know what I mean? people i'm just seeing eyes on you there's more than one eyes that i'm picking up more than one set of eyes i'm picking up here i'm hearing some people ain't ready to hear this type of information but most of y'all are there's more than one eyes pair of eyes that i see looking at you and it's like they 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 entertained they're waiting for you because you're grounded right now you're moving into grounded number four energy here stability is what i'm getting yeah i'm hearing stay calm Stay calm the best that, that you can. You are currently building a, a brand new foundation for yourself. But whoever this is, what, whatever the hell this is, wants to see you out of control, wants to see you out of balance because they get enjoyment from it. What you do when you eating popcorn, a lot of times you're watching something, you're watching movies. You know, you know what I mean? When I, see, when I see the tub of popcorn and look at my series going on, like 
Ain't nobody who heard me say, look at this, y'all. You see what I'm talking about? That's that monitoring spirit. This is confirmation. Y'all got monitoring spirits around y'all. Ain't nobody said nothing about no Siri, but you listening. Fuck out of here. Yo, that's that monitoring spirit energy. Is what I'm picking up. Monitoring spirit. That person, whoever this is, is listening. These, these. Ooh. Why? Why? I'm getting these demons, these this energy, these entities are listening, watching through these people. Okay? This is somebody who may be under doctor's supervision. Somebody who got medical issues. Somebody who depressed. Somebody who need to see a doctor. Something is going, this person may be under the, this may be somebody who's going through depression. Somebody you need to be very, very careful. I'm not saying, oh, everybody's under the, no, I'm talking about this motherfucker right here. I'm talking about this person right here. Y'all, excuse me, but hey, it's how I'm feeling right now. I'm talking about this mofo right here. You feel me? It's that person that I'm talking about. That person might need, might be either under doctor supervision or they mean might need to be under doctor supervision okay this may be somebody who's coming off as needy somebody who's trying to come off as oh i'm so innocent or 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 i am so uh debilitated um to the point where how can i be a threat to you that's that's the trick right there let me use somebody you feel me I'm going to let me use somebody. Let me hop in somebody's vessel who look real innocent, who look like they can't hurt a fly at this moment. But that's the one that's working against you. They working through that person. This energy, you see I'm talking about this. Look at this paparazzi right here. This is this monitoring spirit type of energy that's around the collective right now. And it's all about this love. Look at this heart right here. I'm telling you. Y'all getting praises, y'all getting y'all flowers, y'all getting y'all accolades. People are people are showing you support. People are showing you love. You feel me? People have faith in what you're doing and, and support you and whatever it is you're doing. And this person is really is looking at that and, and sees that. Somebody seeing is seeing what is transpiring around you right now. Somebody is seeing, okay. This change, this positive change, because we got death energy right here. This positive change, and it's a long time coming, right? It's not, it's not, you're not nobody's overnight success. You've been working at this for a long time, you feel me? Or this change that has been coming has been taking this long, a long damn time this, to happen. But you didn't, you didn't give up. That's the thing, you feel me? You didn't give up. Y'all got good news coming to y'all. You feel me? Good news coming to y'all. People wanting to get to know you. You making positive connections or uh, potential positive connections. This is a brand new beginning with the full energy here for you. That's why the energy is so weird around you because one cycle is phasing out or a huge major cycle is phasing out and a new one is beginning. Right? I'm hearing a new one is gearing up. Right? And you got somebody here who's trying to throw poison on your on your uh on whatever you building on especially on your career this could be somebody y'all work with or this person wants to mess with your career do something with your career because you you are you have elevated you're moving on here with the diploma you done learned your lesson you learned your lesson and you're moving forward in life you've learned all that you needed to know with this current cycle and you're moving forward but you got somebody who's up to this devilish tricks i'm getting devil energy here let me get some more from this deck right here. It's devil energy here. This could be somebody who is intoxicated. This can be somebody who is who drinks, or this person is under some sort of influence. What is wine? Wine is also a spirit. What is spirits? I don't know. Google it. You feel me? Google, Google what happened when you drink wine, when you drink alcohol, period. You feel me? What kind of effect it has on your body? Just and spiritually. What kind of effect it has on you? We know medically what it does, but what if, what what is it doing spiritually? You feel me? This could be somebody trying to mesmerize you and like trying to take over you. You know, like uh, when you drink, it kind of it kind of like takes you out of your normal, you know, 
normal headspace or your normal character i feel like this person's trying to influence you in some way so that you're not thinking clearly you feel me yo so that you're not thinking clearly somebody wants you in handcuffs i just saw the handcuffs it's a whole clown out here that's doing this bro there's a whole clown that's doing this what you talking about it's a whole clown that's doing this bro they got you on their radar i'm telling y'all it's giving me sentinel energy from the matrix as soon as you start leveling up with this psychic energy here you started leveling up you started uh glowing you started uh i'm getting you got jupiter energy around you expanding okay you're in some sort of ascension number 11 as well spiritual enlightenment spiritual awakening you're growing spiritually your powers are being activated And they know this. And what they want to do, they want to burn it all down. They want to burn down all your, your whole progress you've got going on for yourself. How far you have come. They want to burn it all down. Okay? Y'all see this. They want to burn it down. You got too much knowledge that you are, you are gaining right now. You're very, very smart. Intuition on point. You got access to things that are hidden from people. And that's why we got this secret life right here, right? I'm hearing you've been laying low and keeping things to yourself. You feel me? But whatever kind of, you just going through some, comment down, down, down below if you just went through some sort of uh, transformation, uh, spiritual awakening type of vibe going on here. Because at the last, something that happened with you, the last, the last thing that happened with you, okay, spiritually, um, they picked up on this, okay? Yeah, see, this is a brand new cycle that you, you, you learning things, you feel me? Yeah, you are learning right now. And that's the diploma energy right here. You've learned your lessons. You, you're elevating right now. You're getting stronger. You're gaining more wisdom. You're gaining more knowledge. And this energy could feel it because now they got you on the radar and now they send the clowns your way. You feel me? Now they think it's a game. Now let me let this person, let me trigger this person so they can entertain me. You feel me? So I can take them out of balance and have them in this, in this energy spiral and out of control. Let me throw rocks and high and, and, and high my hands, right? Let me put these rocks in their pockets so they can sink to the bottom of the ocean. You feel me? So they could drown. I don't want them going nowhere. We're going to stop this. We got. What is this? We got documents. Be careful what you're signing right now. Be careful. Oh. You guys. And we picked up this energy the other day. Soul contract complete. You guys have. I'm hearing you have in front of you a brand new contract that's coming to you. A brand new soul contract. Some of you guys have physical contracts that are coming for you to do great things. <sighs> I'm here to take care of yourself right now. Be careful what you are, who you are letting yourself be around, who you are being influenced by, what you are ingesting, how you are taking care of your body, what kind of nutrients you're putting into your body. What are you subjecting yourself to, right? Cause you got some frogs out here and it, may, and it may not look like what it is, you feel me? It may not look like what it is. And these are coming, be careful. You got friends coming in. I have friends, how many of us have them? You got friends around you. What about this friend? Lucky friends coming around you. And you got some friends who going to jail, you feel me? Somebody getting arrested, whether it's spiritual or whether it's physical. Somebody going to spiritual or physical jail behind some luck that you having, okay? Yo, look at this announcement. Something is getting ready to be announced. What's this? What's this announcement? This is jumped out right here. Monkey, somebody playing around. Somebody putting burdens on you. Somebody talking crap here, okay? You skyrocketing to the top. Somebody getting, somebody getting the gas put, yo, Somebody gassing somebody up here by spreading fake news, lying to people. Be careful of people coming to you telling you lies. 
Mary, tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Be careful, people coming to you, lying to you. God told me to tell you da da da, or this person told me to tell you da da da. Be careful with that stuff, okay? Because if God told them, God should have told you too. Period. We got some sort of announcement, but it's you. You gonna hear about some sort of announcement, but it's fake. You gonna learn that it's fake news. It's somebody playing around with you. Somebody wants you to be burdened with something. I don't know, bro. Whatever this is, somebody wants you to be burdened with something. They don't want you to take off, like you taking off. It's somebody playing, taunting you, playing games. Yeah, they don't want you to take off. What else we got from this tarot? Oh, this is why is energy just jumping out, bro? Tables is turning. Will of Fortune energy here. Tables are turning for you guys. Yeah, new beginnings happening for you guys. With the Knight of Wands. Fresh new offers coming in for you guys. We got some progression with the good news. Good news expanding. We went from the page to the night. We're moving, we moving on up like George and Wheezy. Somebody, y'all about uh, y'all about to get out of this limbo type of energy with the hangman reverse. You about to get out of this energy. You're about to move forward. You may have been at a stalemate or an empath. Things movement is getting ready to happen for you guys. Knight of Swords. You feel me? Movement is getting ready to happen. Things are about to get, get ready to get popping. And things are about to start getting exciting for somebody out here too. You feel me? Watch out with this with this energy that's that's behind you. Tell me about this seven of swords energy. Yeah, this person does not want you to leave the chaos and the confusion behind. They want to keep this energy here with you so it can keep you down. But the, the, the good thing about it is that you don't have to subscribe to anything you don't want to subscribe to right if you don't want to you want to if you don't want to participate in whatever they this this monkeying around this clownery buffoonery this lying this fake news people in your business people trying to if you don't have to you can leave them in the dust and keep it moving that's the thing you you on a rocket up out of here you're being you are being divinely guided right now with the hair on here you on a rocket up out of here you feel me and they can't touch you on this rocket. You feel me? They can, they can try to, but the only person who can stop them or who, or who could allow them to to really to get you like that is actually you. Yeah, it's actually you. Yeah, this person wants you suffering. I feel like this person is suffering right now. This person, somebody's mad that they don't have a hold on on you like they did before, because all of that is over with. Somebody wanted somebody's wanted to come around and stab you in the back one good time to to really mess up this opportunity that you got going this new beginning that you got going right here. But you had it for celebration. Yeah. But your celebration, you feel me? You got friends that are around you, support that's around you, love that's around you. Like I told you before, you feel me? But with the celebration, you got people. You still got this other element with the five of wands of somebody who's wanting to compete with you somebody who's not liking that somebody who has a problem with it an issue with it this a bad apple you feel me a bad apple that's trying to spoil your fun but you have the option of not even uh uh, uh i'm hearing subscribing to it somebody this can be somebody you got subscribed to even more way more in more ways than one refuse the offer yeah, do what is right. The justice energy here and the four cups. You don't have to accept it. You could do what's right and you could I'm getting you put that energy out there, you get back what what you deserve. You feel me? Like if you're doing the right thing, you only accepting nothing but balance in your life. And you're not letting anybody come into your life and bring in disharmony, you feel me? And mess up the energy here. You do things the right way. Yeah, see? Three uh that's just three of uh, three of swords energy right here. When we got that earlier, with um, where is that? With this one, with the heartbreak, it's the same energy here. You got somebody that's wanting to. You got somebody that is wanting to. Uh, they are wanting to see you hurt. Okay, they're wanting you to to not be successful. They're wanting you to to not be abundant. But you have the opportunity to be successful. You got the opportunity to be abundant and have a strong 
uh, positive foundation for yourself. I'm talking about one like a legacy that you could retire on. I don't know what's going on for y'all, okay? I don't know what's going on for y'all, but it's good things. It's good things, good news. Six of Wands and also the Ten of Pentacles. Six of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles. I'm hearing y'all ain't got nothing to worry about. I'm hearing somebody here is worrying. Don't worry about it because look, the will of fortune, the table is turning in your favor. You ain't got nothing to worry about. You got plenty of opportunities here for you for the taking. You feel me? These opportunities are right for the picking. It's, it's going to be up to you whether or not you take them or not and what you do with them. Or you allow these clowns, this paparazzi and these these monitoring spirits to come and trigger you and take you up out there and just take what's yours or or get you to focus on them hey 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 i'm about to be a clown don't listen don't um listen to <clears throat> don't listen don't listen to you know to god or your, your your spirit team don't um what do you call it don't follow the path that you're going don't go out to the success don't go don't go out to your foundation or whatever I'm just hearing some rumbling like somebody trying to shake the table, you feel me? Well, not literally in here shaking the table, but it's like, it, it, it put put that in the mind. Like somebody trying to be sneaky and shake your table, trying to shake your tables being made, and they're trying to shake the things that you have on the table set up for you, try to shake them off the table because they can't sit at your table. Yo, I don't know who this for. I don't know who that is for. But Spirit said, you don't have to. You could continue moving forward. You can sit there and don't give them that energy. Don't give them... If you got to check them, check them and keep it moving. Keep peace in your life. Keep harmony in your life and keep moving forward. There's this energy that is trying to. Trying to. Knock you out of balance with this spiral energy here. And that spiral is a red freaking flag. This is a masculine energy here. Okay, could be a woman in her masculine energy. She very, very, very aggressive. Or she the one that's going to initiate some sort of contact. You feel me? Or it's a man. What's this right here? Yeah, running their mouth. You feel me? Running their goddamn mouth. Running their pie hole. You feel me? Running their mouth. Whoever this man, this woman is, that's how they're gonna try to get you. Running their mouth, trying to trigger you, trying to say things that going strike a chord within you. Yeah. Somebody, yeah, somebody trying to tempt you. You see what I'm talking about? Yeah, look at this confirmation. Somebody trying to tempt you. There's somebody in your own family or somebody that's close to you. I did not tell you I was going to be your mother, your father, your brother, your sister. Somebody, an elder. It's somebody close to you. It could be somebody that's older than you. Or it could be just by a couple of months or whatever. Or it could be just somebody that acts like they're older than you. You know, sometimes we got younger people think that they're older than you. Then they think they, they can bully you. But there's somebody, this, this is hitting close from home. Spirit say hit that cancel button on the ass. Hit that cancel button on them. I'm telling you, somebody gonna try to tempt you out this, and it's gonna be somebody that's close to home who you're not expecting. That's who this, whatever this entity is using, they're using that person. Yeah, look at this blood. This show blood. Somebody, this show a, your, a blood relative is gonna try to do this to you. Mm. A blood relative is gonna try to do this to you. Say don't give their ass nothing. You feel me? Don't give them nothing. Yeah, because a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes. A lot of secrets are being kept. We got this secret life here. Secret life. Somebody's being powered up behind the scenes and you don't even know that. Somebody is under some sort of demonic attachment and you don't even know that. I don't know who this is for. I don't know who this is for. Somebody trying to make more burdens in your life. And that person is somebody who should not be doing nothing like that to you. Should not be trying to make life harder for you. This person trying to take your light and your energy away from you with the queen of wands. But you can burn all that energy away. I'm hearing say your affirmations. Start saying your prayers. Start doing your reversals. Do whatever the hell you got to do. Keep your energy balanced. Okay. Keep your energy balanced. Keep that love in your heart. I'm hearing that's the way to go. It's for you to keep this love in your heart. Keep yourself centered around love. Keep yourself centered around truth. Keep yourself centered around authenticity. That is your way forward. When you have this love energy circle, circling around you, 
covering you. This foolishness they're trying to do is not going to be able to penetrate this love vibration, this love energy. Some of y'all, um, I mean, y'all need to re recognize the power of love, how strong love can be and, and how love can break up this negative energy that's being sent towards you, okay? Specifically, this this energy. Okay, y'all need to center yourself and keep yourself centered around love at this time. That is the message that I got for you guys. If you like it, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more, and comment down below. And let me know how you guys feel about it, if it resonated with you. Okay, y'all take care. Much love and light to everybody out there. Ciao. Mm -hmm.